Welcome to the 2022 Unity Beginners course. This is episode 20, and I will introduce scriptable objects. A scriptable object is a data container asset. It allows us to store data values as assets, which can be loaded during runtime. An important note, a scriptable object is not a runtime data storage but an asset which can be defined during development. Values of scriptable objects cannot be modified on the final build. Scriptable objects are extremely convenient data containers. We don't have to define redundant properties over and over again in different classes. We can also make changes to the values when running our games in the editor without losing the changes after we stop the game. You may argue that an ordinary static class can also be used as data containers. The major differences are that a static class cannot be defined directly as an asset, and changes to the values made during runtime in the editor will not persist. Let's start defining a scriptable object. We first have to create a new c -sharp script. Replace the mono behavior directive with the scriptable object. Remove everything inside a class and define our custom properties. We can specify the path in the asset create menu by adding this directive at the top of the class. Go back to the editor, and when we right-click in the Projects tab, a new option will be available in the Assets Create menu. A data container with our custom properties will be created as an asset file. We can go ahead and define the values directly via the inspector. It is possible to create multiple variants, with each having different values. These assets files can then be used in other scripts. And that is how you create and use scriptable objects. This is episode 20 of the 2022 Unity Beginners course. I am Yellow Flicker and I will see you in the next episode. Stay tuned. <laughs>